what's good everybody if you are new to my channel welcome my name is sasha and i was an escort slash hooker prostitute all that good shit down and around out here in these motherfucking streets for 14 and a half years and i welcome you to my page now today i'm here to talk about the motions that I'm going through, leaving the street life. Now, I have not turned a date since March 8th. And I turned one March 8th, and then I turned another one like two weeks before that. Other than that, the last time I was really active in the game was end of December 2021. So if you want to count my clean time, I got about, I think it's what, five months clean now of being out of the streets and going legit. And I have been updating about how like, you know, everything was good and I was doing fine. Well, today is one of the days where I'm fucking struggling, G. I'm struggling. Because the current line of work that I'm in right now, that's legit. This shit is slow. It's, it's slow right now. And it's hella tedious. And I'm having this feeling today where I miss being Blackjack, yo. You know who Blackjack is? Blackjack was my whole name. You know? I miss being Blackjack at this very moment. At this very moment, I wish I could just post me a motherfucking ad. Oh! Excuse me having on this uh, face mask. I got my wisdom teeth pulled out. And so my face is swollen. Okay, so face mask is what is what's going on today. Anyway, anyway, I'm in a mood tonight where I really just feel like posting me an ad and getting dressed and putting my heels on and going to the motherfucking casino to meet my motherfucking Mark. Like I used to do. And like I know I can do. You know what I'm saying? And not having to go through this other bullshit. Because I know that I can get money. You know? And I'm just really having like... One of the moments where like... You know? I'm 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 kind of grieving... Um... Blackjack. You know? I, it kind of feels like right now... Um, I'm like voluntarily struggling a little bit, you know, and for everybody else that wants to leave the street life or is leaving the street life, when you do leave the street life, you're going to go through the motions, especially if you was in whatever game you was in for a long time, you know? So, really, that's what my channel was about, recording my journey of leaving the street life and cleaning my life up. And I'm here to share with y'all my good days, the good days and the bad days, and the things that I'm learning along the way. Um, yeah, today is a really kind of like weak night for me. Um... Just recently, I was able to make another mega personal profile, which I knew I could make another mega personal profile if I was trying to get on mega personal. The only reason I made this mega personal profile was to show the girls how to get back on mega personals. You know what I'm saying? But now it's like, what do you call it? It's like a tease to me a little bit because I know that I got one and I know that I can just go in there, put my pictures on there, post for some motherfucking out calls get somebody probably somebody that's familiar with me to book me for an out call get dressed get in my car and drive to go pick up a couple hundred or something right quick you know what i'm saying because i really just feel like i ain't got time for this bullshit that i'm going through right now these are the motions that i'm going through tonight okay if you're trying to leave the game, or if you just recently left the game, whatever game you in, selling drugs or whatever, these are the, you're going to have days like this. 
Okay, where you feel like your job is not doing enough, where you feel like you know how to get it quicker and you sick and tired of sitting around and going through the extra bullshit that you go through for the clean money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's how I'm feeling tonight. And so I definitely wanted to hop on here and get this footage of this very moment of my energy and what I'm going through to share with others. Period. You know? And I was feeling like I was sitting here really almost feeling kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Like I wanted to cry a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Because like this shit is a struggle. You know? Especially when I've been in the game for more than half my life. And the game is all I fucking know, bro. This shit real different for me to be moving legit out here. Okay? I've only ever had... One job, one job before my whole life. The other little job I had, it was like a paid internship. Other than that, I had got me a job while I was pregnant with my son because I wasn't going to be posting ads and being in these rooms and putting myself at risk while I was pregnant with my son. So I sucked it up for my son. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, it's been five months clean. And like tonight is one of them nights I'm kind of feeling like, baby, I don't know what to do with myself. Okay. I don't know what to do with myself. And I know that I got some regulars that I could hit up to go pick up me a few dollars to make my motherfucking night right. But I've been trying to go clean. You know? I decided to do this because I feel like nobody else is doing this. When I remember... I was in the room, and I was sick and tired of being in the room, waiting on calls and shit. And I was sick and tired of my fucking life being like that, G, revolving around these tricks and these ads and shit. And I would search on YouTube for leaving the street life, how I quit prostitution, how I stopped escorting, you know, things of that nature. And I wasn't able to find that kind of content. So I don't know if I was the only one looking for that kind of content. But that's one of the main reasons why I decided to make this kind of content. Because somebody else is probably looking for it. And somebody else probably need it. So, yeah. We in real time. And I promise y'all, I'm going to be updating y'all on my good days, my bad days. And all of my emotions and everything that I go through changing my life when I've been in the streets for more than half of my life. Okay? Period. But now, anyways, I was sitting here and, like, I was kind of feeling like I wanted to cry. Like, man, you know, I miss the old days. That's the feeling I was having tonight. Like, gee, I miss the old days. You know? Or I would just go and get money. You know what I'm saying? Like, me sitting here in front of this computer and struggling <laughs> in a way that I'm fucking struggling. Like, in a way, it's like my ego kind of feel like that shit is beneath me a little bit. Because I know how to go and get money, bitch. I'm trained to go. You know? That was the feeling I'm having tonight. And I kind of felt like, you know, I was damn near ready to cry. He was just like, bitch, if you don't put some shit on and go your ass out here and get this motherfucking money, like, what is you doing? You know, that's what just went on in my head. Bitch, what is you doing? Okay, this shit is slow. Like, you know how to go. If you don't get the fuck up and get the fuck up out of this motherfucker and go, that's how I was just feeling. But before that, I had to definitely take time and record this video so that y'all can see the real motions that a motherfucker is going through trying to clean their life up. Okay? I'm determined. And after I get done making this video, I'm going to pray. Thank you for tuning in. And I will see y'all next video. Amen.